Good morning guys. It's currently 8 o'clock in the morning. I got up pretty early today. I got up at like 7 and I woke up feeling like ready to go. I slept through the whole night. I didn't wake up. I've been having like really rough nights of sleep lately with being jet lagged and everything. So last night was really good and I got some sleep. So it just feels like completely different. I have just been pretty productive this morning. Not gonna lie. I haven't been doing much editing on this trip just because I've been in class super busy so I decided to upload a video yesterday I'm also editing my pack with me video where I packed for this trip so if you want to go watch that you can go watch it I think I'm gonna go get breakfast downstairs I've been having the same breakfast every day um, at the hotel that in Rome because they really only have two options and I'm kind of like a little bit tired of having eggs every morning for breakfast so I'm really excited to see what this hotel has you know Italians like I like love their culture I really do I gotta say but like I cannot eat like super sweet things in the morning like cakes they eat like a lot of cakes and like croissants almost just very sweet stuff in the morning I'm also wearing a workout outfit from pink this is such a cute set it's also very comfortable I never really wear purple but you guys said it looked good on me on Instagram so thank you <laughs> maybe I'll wear it more hi guys so I just went out for a quick run and I'm in the hotel gym right now I swear I'm <laughs> I've never seen another person in this hotel. I think we're the only per people staying in this hotel because it's empty. It's kind of weird, but also really cool. So there's no one in the gym. And I think I'm just gonna do a quick like mad fit abs workout. I haven't worked out in like a long time. <laughs> So I'm really actually happy. It feels really good to get like the endorphins and the adrenaline running. So yeah. <laughs> just said that I didn't want something sweet but I just had one of these things I do not know what they're called looks like some kind of pastry and it was so good <laughs> but my stomach is like it feels so weird when I have sugar first thing in the morning I don't know why but this place is so nice we're the only one here Okay, so breakfast today is granola with some yogurt. We got some latte di mandorla, which is almond milk, and un cappuccino con latte di mandorla. Hello guys, so our first touristy thing we're doing today is going to the Duomo and I am going to take the bus. We're gonna take the bus because it's cheap and it works. And I'm helping my family navigate because I'm kind of used to this Italian life now. It's actually quite easy. All you have to do is plug in your maps where you wanna go and then it will say how long it is by bus. And then you just scroll down and it will show you which bus stop and how to get to the bus stop and if there's any other stops that the bus has to make if you have to make a connection to get another bus to your destination. That's what I've been doing most of the time for transportation here. Guys, I don't I don't think this name is too appealing anymore. <laughs> These are the gates of paradise, but they have an actual gate in front of it, <laughs> so you cannot see it very well. Hello 
guys, so I'm at a Zara right now because I don't have any shirts that are acceptable to wear inside of a church, so I have to buy one. Honestly, it's my fault for not packing any shirts on this Florence trip because I left them all in Rome. I'm thinking I'm gonna get this shirt from Zara, but I was just realizing how hard it is to find like normal length shirts nowadays. Like everything is cropped. Everything is spaghetti straps. Like, it's so hard to find it. What do we think? Classy? Classy or no? I think it's pretty classy. Guys, there's these cute little cafes everywhere. So adorable. And then, oh, pistachio. Is that cheese though? I don't even know. It looks like a cake. Oh Look how big the gelato is, guys. That is crazy. Comment down below which is your favorite flavor of gelato. Ooh, don't go that far. Mine is definitely hazelnut. Okay, so um, we're about to buy tickets for the top of the, what is this, the cathedral? But this isn't the cathedral. We're about to climb up the stairs to go to the top of Santa Maria Church. You realize that says no tickets. No tickets? No ticket office. So when, what is this line for? To maybe start climbing up. Maybe I should. Okay. Yeah, we don't have tickets yet. But I'm kind of tired right now, so hopefully I can uh, can make it through these stairs. And I'm just here for the view. I really want to see what the view looks like from up there. started to climb up the stairs and I'm already out of breath almost there we have arrived no that wasn't that bad good exercise Bruschetta. Yeah. Yummy. Guys, this is so good. It's the best I've had in Italy. The best pasta I've had. Okay, we're at Pensavo Peggio, which is, I think, I thought of worse. I think that's what it means. So you guys should come here. It's kind of like a hole in the wall. I found it on Yelp because Yelp is really helpful. Good morning, guys. It is my last and final day in Florence, which is super sad, but I feel like I've gotten in a lot here. Like I've seen a lot of the main sites. This morning we are going to the Uffizi and I am just so excited because I had a two quarters of art history in a row. So I'm just like very like fresh on that information and I just studied a lot of paintings that were in the Uffizi so I'm kind of ready to see those I hope I get to see them all today but I had like the hardest time picking out what to wear this morning and like getting myself ready I don't know why I just did not bring enough clothes for this trip and I'm wearing this super fancy dress because it was either this or like kind of an ugly outfit I'm not gonna lie so I chose my like overdressing instead of underdressing which is always the way to go yeah we kind of have to go now because our scheduled time for the museum is at like 8 45 so we kind of have to make a run for it we have yet to see a single person oh no my dad just got his arm stuck in the elevator <laughs> Florence and it's only like 
10 o'clock right now and we've already been to the museum. We spent like two hours in there and it was really, really fun. restaurant that I found, found on Yelp and it's called Shake Cafe and I ordered a smoothie bowl. I think I got like a dragon fruit smoothie bowl. Oh my gosh and they also had matcha lattes so I got one too and I'm very excited. I thought I would never drink another matcha latte until I was back in the US but I was wrong. I don't do this for no clout, hey I got so much back I think